Hello, welcome to a new video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you the best value perfume I think there is on the market today, and that is Davidoff Cool Water Intense. This is how the packaging looks like. It's not uh, nothing special, nothing particular. It's uh, the typical cardboard with some plastic on top and that's it. And the bottle itself, it's also like, mm, okay, it's a bottle, it's in glass, it's blue, it has a nice logo here, like all the Davidoffs, and the plastic cap, and the normal sprayer, so really nothing special. But what is really special about this perfume, and that's what a perfume should have, is the way it smells and the longevity and the value for the money so this is such a great great perfume so i can tell you that once you spray it you get like this boost of green mandarin like poof and this is starting to to like make a little field around you so like it has a crazy projection just from a little spray and this after a few minutes becomes a bit deeper and you can get into the next notes which in the description it says that is coconut water and amber but i don't know i i feel a bit of the coconut not much of the amber but the way this perfume evolves, it's so, so, so nice. And like with just three notes for this one, they have made a wonderful perfume, which costs around 30 euro, depending where you get it from. This is the 75 milliliter bottle. So I took just a little one to see if I really like it. I paid about 20 euro on Amazon Germany. I was shocked. I was shocked how good and how cheap and how big performance is this perfume this stays on the skin for eight or nine hours and for a perfume that costs 25 euro or 30 euro to have this beautiful smell and this strong longevity this is just great so and the perfumer who who created this perfume she is called anik menardo created bois d'armini for Guerla, Bois d'Argent, Hypnotic Poison from Dior and also contributed to the Aqua di Gio Purom creation, so the original one, so she knows her craft. So in today's world where you have uh, Aqua di Gio Profondo which smells hmm, okay, or like uh, countless flankers which they put a bit of sweetness and a bit of citrusy and they expect a summer heat to have such a nice cheap good performing and decent perfume that is just great from from their side so for me which i have about 46 perfumes at home and also very expensive ones i can now understand which perfume is good value for money and which is not and this one for sure for the price is just unbeatable really unbeatable so if you're like a student and you don't have uh, much money and you would like to smell nice, go with this one. If you're in high school and you don't have much money but you want to smell nice, go with this one. And even if you have like a strong collection with 30, 40 perfumes, niche, expensive ones, you will also enjoy this one in a summer day with a t-shirt with heat outside. This green mandarin will just pop and have this nice bubble of uh, freshness around you this is such a great value look i have in my collection this beautiful perfume from fragrance du bois called wood noir intense look at this packaging look how it looks this one costs 25 euro this probably even the box cost more than 25 euros so this is a 600 euro perfume and i enjoy this so much even having access to beautiful exquisite perfumes like this one so believe me this is great great value and 
More than that, I have not been paid to do this review and I have not been contacted by the producer of this perfume for the summer, for the season that is coming right now. This is the one to go with. In this perfume you would have green mandarin orange as a start, as a top note, but also in this one, in Aqua di Gio Profondo Lights. And actually even if this is a flanker for Aqua di Gio, I can tell you that it has a very similar smell with this one after a while. So Aqua di Gio Profondo Lights, after a few minutes after you sprayed it on your skin or your clothes, it smells like this one because they both have this green mandarin orange in the top note but for some reason this one after a while smells more like this one rather than aqua di Gio. so i guess they understood that the formula used by davidoff intense cool water intense is a winning one so that's why they implemented it also here of course you cannot expect a fancy packaging look at this plastic that's basically a piece of plastic with some writing with a barcode and like a very very thin cellophane on top but who cares you are curious about this and the juice inside and even if most likely the juice is transparent and has no natural ingredients for the price i guess it's impossible to put natural ingredients into this perfume but it does the job well, it performs a lot, it smells great and it doesn't break the bank. If this is not the king of cheapies, I don't know which one is. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you found this review useful. Please like it, comment down below what is your experience with Davidoff Cool Water Intense and if you like it or not. And please subscribe to see similar videos like this in the future. Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.